This is the Channel 6 Spotlight. A local entomologist is perking up ears and antennae due to his rather unconventional invention. Meet Dr. Oscar Odom, who is breaking down barriers between humans and insects. I'm an entomologist, but I like to say that I'm a bugologist, and that means someone who ogles bugs for a living and for science. Dr. Odom's passion for bugs goes beyond the ordinary. He's on a mission to understand these tiny creatures more personally. My colleagues call me a weird little bugger, but I think they just don't understand or love bugs like I do on a, on a deep human level, you know, with tenderness and intimacy and just, just like knowing the heart of bugs. Enter the Bug Kiss device, a small pair of lips designed for getting to first base with insects. I invented the Bug Kiss device to get closer to bugs one-on-one -on -one and to really just understand what drives them, their affections, their hopes and desires and dreams. Inspiration for the strange invention came from above. As an entomologist, I got tired of just watching the bugs, you know, just creeping around, looking at them, spying on them. I wanted to, you know, reach out and get into the bug world and, and you know, like the, like the painting of God touching Adam's hand, you just got to reach down into the bug world and just give them a little affection, you know, a little smooch right on the lips. If you're hesitant to make out with creepy crawlies, you're not alone. But Dr. Odom aims to change that. It's just so sweet and, you know, most bugs are so much more loving and affectionate than you would even think. Most people are scared of bugs. They're afraid of, you know, getting tickled by the hairy legs or getting bit by the tiny little fangs that ain't gonna hurt you. It's probably just trying to give you a kiss. According to Dr. Odom, most bugs are far more loving and affectionate than we might think, and he assures us that Bug Kiss is designed to be gentle. You can see that the mini lip is mounted on a shock absorber so that you don't crush the bugs when you kiss them. And if you need to kiss a bug that's smaller, it has a micro lip attachment that you simply insert the micro lip into the mini lip and then you can smooch on some little guys. For bug enthusiasts who want to keep track of their insect encounters, Dr. Odom has crafted a unique field guide. I illustrated it and I give you a kissability score, the name, some notes of mine for the field, and then I give you a space where you can check off whether you've kissed him, what notes you have, and then your own score. So you may not agree with my kissability score. That's the fun of it. So if you find yourself in the garden and need to lock lips with an insect, bug kiss might just be the answer. For Channel 6, I'm Kathy Drelik. Good night.